Hello, fellow digger. Kenny Digger here, which I'm sure you know that already. Look at the screen. Um, I got a buddy, Davey M, but he's been trying to get my address for a while. I'm surprised he didn't have to give up. He asked me for it, and I tried to do a reply on Gmail, and he didn't get it yet. And I tried again, still didn't get it. So he asked me to just try to send him a piece. Of so I did, and I told him, you know, if you get this, but you know, if not, I'll figure out another way to get it to you. And that was yesterday, and I hadn't heard anything from it, so I, I can only assume he didn't get it. So uh, I'm just going to put the address right up here on the screen. And for those of you that are out there saying, no, Penny Deer, don't do that. You know, dude, I live in an area where even if I'm not home, my neighbors watch my house. So, you know, just because I'm not home, there's not a car in the driveway. In fact, right now, just because there's not a car in the driveway don't mean I'm not sitting here. Uh, but it, it's, it's not a good idea to come sneaking around you know, unannounced. Uh, you, you're liable to hear the, the little noise followed by a really loud boom, at which point the best you can hope for is your bridges light up on fire with rocks off. And, uh, I don't know from experience, but I have heard that that is a painful thing to go through. Uh, you've got salt on the cut or lemon juice on the cut. You, you know how that burns. Imagine having your bridge is full of, of rock salt. Uh, it wouldn't be a fun thing to go through. Uh, the worst you could hope for is that you're up there banging on the gate asking St. Peter, can you come in? Or wait for all of to give you your 72 virgins or whatever, you know, whatever you believe in. So uh, I'm going to put my address up on the screen here for you, Davey. There you go, you can see it. Thomas McNeil, 4209, Highway 84 West, Lot 2, Wiggum, Georgia, 39897. So you can pause that and write it all down, but I see that, that Georgia might not be real clear. That's G A. The abbreviation for Georgia. But uh, you can pause that and write it down. And anybody else out there that wants my address, go ahead and write it down. Because, uh, you know, people send me coins all the time. And I love it. I love it. Especially right now when I, I can't get out and go to check it all. Uh, all these coins people have been sending me have been uh, been responsible for me keeping my sanity. Uh, if I actually kept my sanity, I don't know. We're gonna have to, I'm gonna have to think on that one. I might. I'm, it might be gone out the door some damn where. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I think I kept it. But uh. I love these coins. Once I get them, they stay on the wall. They're not. They're not ever going to go anywhere. Uh, like J Mo's got this contest. You get two of his wicked diggers. You pick one. You add something to the the other wicked digger and make another contest. I said, dude, I'd love to be part of it, but all I've got that I could possibly put in there would be coins that people sent me, and that ain't happening. Never will I part with any of the coins that anybody sent me. Or artifacts. Uh, Elvis, Rockhead, Ohio, sent me some, some nice little arrowheads. And I got them mounted up on the wall. And I would love to get some more of them. Now, I'm sorry to say, I'm I'm part Cherokee, part Creek Indian, and part Scott. Uh... My dad used to say he was mostly Scott, but I don't drink, so I can't make that that say I can make it, but it'd be a lot. Uh, but uh, 
I don't have any airhead except for the few that, that uh, Brock had in there. I've got some little, some dream catchers all over the house. Well, I'll, I, this camera's got a reverse front and a rear camera. And I know how to make it work before I start filming. But once I start filming, I'm bossing. See, I got the the tapestry over there, the, the Indian thing. And I got some dream catchers hanging up there, and I got that one dream catcher hanging up there that's got some some uh, uh, peregrine falcon tail feathers in it. There was one out here in the middle of the highway that, that a 18-wheeler had hit and killed, and I buried him, and I didn't think he would begrudge me a few tail feathers for burying him. And there's some of my coins in those arrowheads. I've got 16 more plaques back in the bedroom full of coins. So, as you see, once I get them, it's like they go into a black hole, dude. They ain't coming out. <laughs> uh, they're mine at that point, and I'm not. I'm not parting with them. It was a gift. Uh, it wasn't given to me to make money on. It wasn't given to me to give away. The gifts were given to me in in, uh, in good faith and, and from the heart. And they're staying with me. Now, I don't know if my, my blood son... He, he might want some of them. I need to talk to him about that. Uh, where I can put it in my will. Cause if he wants some, I'll split them between him and my stepson. And I know my stepson, once he gets them, he'll keep them until the day he dies. So, they're not going to go anywhere. And, man, I love those coins. And some of them have they, they're all special to me. Some of them have really, truly blown me away, like that hammered penny that uh, Dave sent me at Christmas time. Oh, man. I never thought I'd even hold a hammered coin. Whew. Much less own one. And I've got an Edward the first silver hammered penny up on my wall. Man. Anyway. The only purpose of this video was to let Davey know my address, so mission accomplished. Davey, I'm looking forward to getting those Chinese coins, and they are going right up there on that wall. Depending on how many of them there are, it may go in one of those red frames. But I've got five of them available, so I don't care if you send me a bucket full of them. They're going up on that wall. And in advance, dude, thank you. And anybody else out there that thinks they might want to send me some coins or some artifacts or airheads or whatever, uh, in advance, thank you. Because these are really helping me keep my sanity, helping me keep it together and stay upbeat. But it, it's, yeah, it, it's kind of hard watching everybody out there detect it and I can't do it. So, <clears throat> they're helping me keep it together. And thank you guys. I really appreciate it. So, till next time, this is your one and only Penny Digger. And we've discussed this before. Thank God there ain't more of it.